This is a continuation of part three. When I say intense though, I'm talking about, it's going to translate on video real fast. It's going to be moving pretty quick. See how close I'm getting them? And everything's the same height. I'm going to get even closer because I want to fit all my pictures. If I can't fit all my pictures, then I'll have to adjust them. And I'm thinking like this. Like this. I think I have them in the wrong order. Like that. See, now they're just stacking up. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go over here and I'm going to move them in a little closer. And adjust them. See how much work goes into that, huh? This is just one clip of this video we're going to make. So this is the process of going through the video. So I'm lengthen that one a little bit. Then I'm going to do another series of close ones. Then I'm going to, I'm going to lengthen that one a little bit. Just so I could fit that in there. No, I'm good, man. So as you can see here, let me plug my headset in, see if it makes a difference while I'm in live. I think it does make a little bit of quality difference, but um, the Bandicam recorder, it's not the greatest, guys. I don't use it all the time, but I'm trying to use it. So I'm, I'm just adjusting these pictures. It's going to be a fast time lapse. I could always make more adjustments. Okay, and I'm going to try to fit these last three in. Uh, it only takes so many pictures, so I have to sacrifice um, this ending part, which is okay. I'm going to sacrifice it then. Now we got to hit that little square in order to... And I'm going to have the ending here. Uh, we'll have it windmill out, okay? We'll have it zoom out. I haven't really used those. Okay, let's look to take a look at it from the startup. I'm going to make this video with uh, Indian Native American music on it because I really like it. So what you're watching for, how it how it develops. If something's out of sync, you can always put it in a different location. But you see the sun is sitting right there. And what I want to show is the sun. Um, I really can't do it the way I have these pictures. I might have to change them, guys. Which will take a few minutes. I won't film it. But as you can see, how it comes up real nice, slow. Got the right rhythm on it. Kind of hangs out on a few clips. Now watch what I do here. I'm going to hit this button. I can go back to the beginning. This is the only problem about this program. It always starts from the beginning. Hit that button so I could go in here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to load music up. If I go, if I go no music right here, I can go up to 10 minutes. So I'm going to go up to, five minutes. And I'm going to set it up. Oh. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to add music. Okay, so what I did was I stuck the last four pieces. I added music, which I'll go over. Now I'm going to play it for you. I'm just going to put some flute music. I think I started out with this song, Giving God Glory, for my new video channel. But you can see, after the sunset, clearly something's still going on here. Watch, right over here on the left. Look at this little moon object up there. Little round object there. Some went down right here. What's this? I still got the reflection from this. So it's still pretty good. Let's go. Okay, 
so. Tell you what I'm doing right now. You don't have to do much cropping, but <clears throat> if you wanted to. All you gotta do is hit that little square. There's nothing to crop. You got two ways of cropping here. You can crop right here or start animation immediately and how long the animation lasts. So I can go like six seconds. Makes a difference in the video. Um, also, you've got this ability to plus size. You can increase the size. And as you go along, increase the size a little bit more. I want to increase the size. You want to slide it over so you get the best part of the picture. These are all just easy tools for free, guys. Okay, I'm going to drop down the next picture. I'm going to drop down to that. Oh, make it so it doesn't drop so hard. And then we'll drop the next one down a little bit. And then we'll go back to the original footage. I say you can move it up and down, so I want to hide that stuff. Hide all that writing. This was taken on 27, I think. 28th, 25th, see how fast, you get so much footage sometimes, press your drop down, drop down, hide that, I'm going to hide, the, just hide the logo, just a little bit better, you know, you see a little bit over there. You got the little clicker here you can use a little quicker. Now I'm gonna start going up on my picture. You just gotta be creative, wherever you like it, whatever you like it. I'm on that one go nine seconds. We got plenty of room. This one I'm going to have go to 12 seconds. This just gets better. And then I'll have it drop back just a little bit. So I'll bring it up just a little bit, drop back. Drop back. And this is your last picture. Drop back. No, it's not your last picture. This one drops back. See, and it just gives it a little bit of life. You got that perfect filter going on. That one I'm going to bring up a little bit. Oh, I hate when it does that. It does that on purpose sometimes. You have to reset it. You don't have to go back. Don't push play. Sometimes it just does that. I don't know why. Okay, yeah, I'm back on course. Usually when I give it, uh, see, it's giving me a hard time. I'm not, I'm not increasing it enough to, to move it. No, I'll just leave it. Pretty intense footage. 